Welcome back to another social gaming news video. Today's video is about the largest Houthi attack today in the Red Sea with drones heading directly towards HMS Diamond. A British warship HMS Diamond shot down seven drones launched by Iranian backed Houthi fires in the Red Sea in an operation with US forces to repel the largest drone and missile attack to date. Grant Shapps, the Defence Secretary, said the drones had been heading towards HMS Diamond, a Type 45 destroyer deployed by the UK to help protect shipping in the region, as well as commercial vessels on Tuesday night. On board HMS Diamond during the latest engagement, they shot down 18 one-way attack drones designed to explode on impact. Fired by Houthi militias in, in Yemen, along with two anti-ship cruise missiles and one anti-ship ballistic missile. The attack started at about 9.15pm local time, according to a statement by the US military describing it as a complex attack. Overnight HMS Diamond along with the US warship successfully repelled the largest attack from the Iranian backed Houthis in the Red Sea today. Um, Grant Krapp said, deploying Sea Viper missiles and guns, Diamond destroyed multiple attack drones heading for her and commercial shipping in the area, with no injuries or damage sustained to Diamond or her crew. The UK alongside allies have previously made clear that these illegal attacks are completely unacceptable and if continued, the Houthis will bear the consequences. We will take the action needed to protect innocent lives and the global economy. British warship did exactly what it was designed to do. HMS Dyer under the Daring Class Type 45 air defence destroyer with the, which joined the fleet in 2011. There is nothing much to see on the Type 45 before it goes into action. It's a boxy looking ship and apart from the standard 4.5 inch naval gun near the bow and a wildcat helicopter on the stern, the rest of it looks to be a series of containers. But when Sea Viper is fired, it seems to explode out of the deck vertically upwards before it sets its course towards whatever target it's taken on. And it doesn't miss. Iran backed Houthis say the attacks are aimed at ending the air and ground offensive on the Gaza Strip following the 7th of October attacks by Hamas. That's all from Social Gaming News. Thank you for watching.